if for some reasons you put one equipment you connect the, the neutral with the with the ground or the ground with the neutral because there are technicians there are electricians dedicated to work in a in residential electricity or industrial electricity and they say that the neutral and ground can be connected together this is not possible in marine application remember in marine applications only at the source of the power neutral should be connected with ground after that should be separated separated uh, boost bar for neutral and separated boost bars for hot never put together if somebody enter in the boat and work installing other equipment and connect together this with this and this one right now is hot you, it's catastrophic if this one right now is hot and you connect suddenly the neutral with the ground the ground right now the bonding the bonding is hot 120 remember what equipments are connected to the bonding system to the to the bonding bus bar you remember the true holes uh, the metallic fuel tanks uh, all the metals inside of the boat shall be connected to the bonding to the bonding metal if the bonding metal if the bonding metal right now is hot the corrosion in the fittings the corrosion on the true holes the corrosion on the transducer is accelerated and the boat suddenly is sink because those elements are perforated because the corrosion is accelerated this is critical if you have reverse polarity in a boat immediately immediately the bonding have power the bonding have ac power what is the enemy uh, of the bonding system okay the enemy of the bonding system is the current the extra current if the extra current is ac is more catastrophic because accelerate the corrosion in between two dissimilar metals together faster what happens when you have two dissimilar metals together in a marine environment you have galvanic corrosion what happens if additionally when you have two di different metals together you have extra current passing through the metals the corrosion is accelerated especially if in between both of them you have humidity the corrosion is accelerated and the more noble metal attack the less noble metal and destroy the less noble metal this is catastrophic for that reason if you have the light of reverse polarity of the reverse polarity indicator on you need to solve the problem immediately if not probably your bonding boost bar right now is powered with uh, ac power with 120 or 240